This is The Woody Show. And into another new hour. Insensitivity training for a politically correct world on a Friday morning. Oh, yeah. Where's the jack? <laughs> Right. Yeah, yeah, where? Let's go. Where is the jack, baby? <laughs> let's go, Ray. Now that I've rediscovered that clip, that's okay. back in rotation. You know what, Greg? Sweet. Let's effing go. Yeah. <laughs> oh, where's the jack? Oh, LFG. where's the jack? <laughs> oh, where's the jack? Yeah. <laughs> Boom, baby. Oh. 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 You know how bad and overused that phrase has gotten? Is I heard it on NPR. What oh, they God. said, let's go. They said it was like somebody was playing and they were talking about, of course, the women's national soccer team. Natch. And she said, mm-hmm. LFG. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> wow, heck yeah. And that's even extra edgy for NPR. That, that uh, shows you how lame that yeah. phrase is. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait. On every uh, goddamn text you think days. any phrase is lame? That's bizarre. What? <laughs> what? Yes, All right, well, God it's... forbid I be a thought leader. <laughs> it's uh, July 28th. <laughs> Thought later. Thank you. 2023. I'm Woody. That's Ravy. LFG, baby. There's uh, Greg Gorey. Uh, thought follower. Ravy and I are on the anti Let's yes. Go train. Thank you. We're the conductors. <laughs> uh, Menace is here. What we is up? Sea Bass. We got Sammy. We got, Sammy. Don't we got think Bort. About Caroline. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, time for the Friday Fail Story. All these people thought they had the perfect plan, the plan that can never go wrong, but somewhere along the line, it went from being a great idea to one big stinking mega uber ultra. Yeah. Ah, that was pretty good. That was nice. That was that nice. nice. That's hey, That's last, good. last two rounds of that, it was okay, but not great at all. That was pretty damn good. Like All it. right. Okay. There's oh, a let's uh, go. All right. I'm, I'm LFG. Yeah. <laughs> There's a uh, big time bullfighting star, Greg, named Andres oh. Rocare, who's oh, also known as the Messi of Matadors because mm. he's that awesome at messing with bulls. Okay. okay. But at a show in Spain this week, he got gored by a 1,100 pound bull who caught him with a horn right through his thigh. Oh, I literally no. saw this video about 10 minutes ago. It was insane. <laughs> Took him for a ride around the arena. Oh, jeez. Slammed him into the stadium's boards uh-huh. and then tossed him in the air. Huh. So other Wait. matadors, they jumped in the help, and uh, that's when the bull then gored them as well. Good. Oh, no. Everyone taken to the hospital. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Failed. I cannot believe in this day and age they're still bullfighting. This, yes. It's pure so torture. Weird. Do yeah. they not have clowns? To distract the bull? I don't know. I don't. That's rodeo. It's dude. not yeah. a rodeo. Yeah. And where were the clown fit between the bull, the cape, yeah. and the matador? Uh, I tried to think of what he was talking about at first. I'm like, yeah. oh, he's thinking of rodeo. In the barrel, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. <laughs> Bullfighting is way classier than that. Uh, yeah. So uh, let's see. So and that's yeah, that's that's for like bull riding and you yeah. know. Mm-hmm. Horses. Oh, he's. I'm he's, getting. Oh, he's. Okay. Getting. Okay. okay. <laughs> I was getting the whole time. Got it. All right. Well, you don't know. We got jokes. All right. <laughs> Uh, you know how Greg's dream is to go to like uh, Columbia to get abs sculpting mm-hmm. and things like Wouldn't that. Wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> well, this mom of six, she went over to Turkey to get a mommy makeover. Okay. Oh, no. And now she's been left in severe pain, lumpy and bumpy uh, for the discount mommy makeover. Her tummy now goes into a V shape. It's bumpy. Ugh. One of her boobs is bigger than the other. Her right arm puckers where it's been sewed too tightly together. Oh. $9,000 later. It's good deal. She went there for yeah <laughs> to Istanbul for the tummy tuck, the breast lift, abdominal fat removal. You look twenty two again. <laughs> right, I promise. She says her body feels quote tight and odd. Oh. Yeah, Ooh. it looks so sitting. and bumpy. It looks gross. Your well, husband's so pleased. Oh, yeah, not <laughs> at all. Find you uh-huh. mega hot. Greg Gordy, yeah. you next. Come here. <laughs> I give you V. <laughs> And not the one that you want. Right. <laughs> yeah. on your arm. I give you actual yeah. V here in Turkey. A man in Florida was arrested after spraying a woman in the face with a garden hose. Oh, and he geez. did it because he thought that uh, she was on his property. Oh. So they're yelling and screaming. He turns the hose on her. The cops, they're called. And uh, it turns out that she wasn't even on his property. He was wrong about where his property line ended. And so he was arrested for simple battery. Oh, no. <laughs> Failed. All righty, then. <laughs> Don't cross my property line. Yeah, I had, a, uh, I had a neighbor once who was giving me crap about, you know, something I was doing with the yard. And um, he goes, well, you're on my property. I'm like, I know for a fact that it's not your property. But just to be sure, brought the survey people out. Turns out 
I wasn't even near it. Like I was three feet off the my own Ooh. property line into oh, wow. my property. Oh wow! So I'm like, dude, you have less property than you even thought you had. Yeah, it was great. He moved. Bye. <laughs> yeah. You will be missed. Uh, here's one about this mom in Georgia who made her child set their house on fire. Ask me why. Why? Why? So they could collect the insurance money, of course. Oh, that's a okay. good reason. Yeah. And uh, this just wasn't a one-time thing. She made the kids oh. set the house on fire at least twice. The total insurance payouts were $77,000, but the cops the whole time were suspicious. They looked more into it, and that's when they figured out what the real story was. So mom was arrested, charged with arson, insurance fraud, aggravated assault, cruelty to children. She'll be uh, spending close to 10 years in fail. Jeez. Yeah. Mm. Fail. Uh, like, lady, only do it Worth once. It. Don't get greedy. <laughs> uh, a guy yourself. who was on vacation in Jamaica, he attempted to drink all 21 of the cocktails featured on the bar's menu. Oh, I saw this Nothing guy. wrong with that. Ooh. 53-year-old guy. Pretty cool. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, now he's dead. Oh. 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 Fail. Oh. Don't be a Alcohol a poisoning? Watch this, man. Yeah. <laughs> Over in the UK, a group of parrot owners organized a get-together where they all went on a walk. With their parrots, oh, because nice. when you're a bird owner and you want to take them out for a Ayo, walk, I have a guy that walks a parrot in my neighborhood. An uninvited guest, in this case a falcon, flew in Uh-oh. and attacked them. Oh, oh my God. Some oh, of the no. parrots abandoned their owners and Bye. got the hell out of there. Oh, my God. <laughs> One woman was able to track her parrot, saw that it was uh, in the upper cliffs of the mountain that they were on. So she climbed up there to get them. And then once she got up there, she got stuck. And had to be rescued. Oh, oh damn. Failed. A terrible walk. Of course he walks the parrot in the neighborhood, not on a mountain. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, they don't want to be out there in nature. No. Yeah, where all I the see. falcons are. Yeah. And uh, finally, my favorite fail story of the week. Police in South Carolina went to a house to serve a warrant. As they were standing there at the front door, they noticed this guy make a run for it out from the side of the house. So they're like, well, it must be our guy. They chased after him. The dude eventually jumped into a nearby lake. Swam a short distance before disappearing under the water. Okay. And the next time they saw him is when his body was fished out of the water downstream. He had drowned. No. Dead. Which no. by itself is a fail, but uh, this is a double fail because the cops weren't even there for him. Oh. <laughs> damn. They were looking for another guy. Oh, but, you know, yeah. we'll never know that because, you know, dead. Well, oh, damn. <laughs> Fail. You think if you're serving a warrant, you would have somebody covering the side door? Yeah. <laughs> I thought they covered all the doors. Well, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't think this guy was the Unabomber. Oh. You know, I think it was just like... He, no. like, we wasn't a, running scared. Yeah, we got, like, a stack of warrants to go serve. They just, you know, go serve them. That's it. But, yeah, this guy was like, oh, they're here for me. Oh, no. <laughs> Makes a run for it. What a dumbass. Yeah.